circle again. <laughs> we're gonna walk the tulip tree preserve because they have this is like a forest of tulip trees. They're like 200 year old trees and they're ginormous. And then connect to the hidden pond trail and walk along the water. We are the Falco family. Brian, Serena, Cameron, Kendall, and Savannah. We're a family of five driven by purpose and fueled by love. We decided to trade in the traditional school life for a life where every day is an adventure of faith and love. From a small photography business grew a love of memory keeping and filmmaking that turned into a full blown dream of becoming a family of filmmakers exploring the truth about education. So we're learning to document our adventures in homeschool business and life and tell stories of how we live and what we learn. I think everybody missed you. All right, so talk to us. I want to hear your thoughts about quarantine. Honest thoughts of quarantine? Yes, honest thoughts. It's just terrible. You can't do anything anymore. It's terrible. What types of things would you want to do? Play with my other friends. They would well, like to another... play soccer again. And I want to swim. It's been kind of hard. It's been kind a bit difficult. Kind of? Kind of? Okay, a okay, bit. wait. <laughs> But one thing we always try to remember is life, there's going to be things that come along that bring difficult times, but we always get to choose. So today we are out touring one of the Delaware State Parks with one of our favorite Twitter. friends. It's like a bee next to the fly next to the bee. Come from Mars. That looks cool. You running into stuff? I'm running into stuff. <laughs> to go on a hike. And we saw a different kind of tree. We saw a twisty tree. Oh yeah, we did. It mm -hmm. was like one tree going up and then another tree twisting around it like a screw. Oh, that was like cool. Like stairs, but. We saw huge rocks and fallen trees. Oh, and wild raspberries. Quarantine has been really hard, but. We swam in a lake a couple days ago. Finally got to see my best friend, Violet. And we swam in the Hidden lake together. It was a creek. It was much bigger than I thought it would be. I thought it would be like a I thought tiny it would be like pond. just for your feet. Yeah, like super shallow. One thing that was really fun is that there was like a bunch of seaweed. Way more than a bunch. A lot of seaweed. We got to skip rock. There were tadpoles. Found oh. geodes in. I was being a mermaid with my tail swifting. And we were opening our eyes underwater. Geodes mm -hmm. are rocks. Mm -hmm that form crystals inside of a long have time. Very long time. It's just a couple of years. A couple of very soon. Hmm, what else did we do? Oh, Kendall made seaweed hail. Oh, he had a seaweed <laughs> wig. That was funny. The current. It, it was just push us to so where we were supposed fun. to be. Push that us. was fun. Yeah, push us. It's not push fun. Us. It was fun. We saw this tree that you could go inside of. Oh, oh a hole. This big tree. With and then a there hole was a top. It. A top that you could sit on, too. I liked it. I really liked it. Incredible.
<laughs> it feels That's so good to be out That's here. That's kind of a creek. It is. It is a creek. So it's like a small creek. With our favorite friend. <laughs> it's a social distance celebration. So the kids are having a good time. So anyway, they're having a good time being able to social distance and hang with their friends. This trail is what? Two miles? I think. Our two, our two miles. <laughs> We're gonna eat, hang with our friends, and then see what else we can get into today. Nice little, uh, <laughs> I didn't either. I, I guess that's one of the um the the tiny blessings in this whole situation is being able to explore what's right in your backyard. Your first hike. That's my second hike. That was my third hike. I mean, that was my third hike. Official hike. Remember rock climbing? It's kind of a hike. That's not a hike. That's just I a hike. It a hike. That's just a hike. A hike. There was this giant rock that was like this wide and like this tall, and I just got yeah. on and jumped down, landed on my feet. But it's feet. not like rocks grow, so how did it get that thing? That was my question. You stole my question. That was when we... The lesson. No matter the circumstances, you can always find a way to have fun. We just told you find a way to have fun like we do. Quarantine is really, really hard to grow through, but we find a way to have fun. It's been kind of hard not seeing your friends and not doing normal things. Well, the way we do it is just finding a way to have fun. Just saying. Pretty much all I have to say, right? Okay, I'm tired. I don't know if I'm gonna make it. <laughs> you better make it. <sighs> Kids had a blast in that water. It was really nice. I didn't know they was gonna do a whole swimming thing in the water. Now, um, we gotta make it through the rest of the hike. I don't know how long. At least the trees are keeping us nice and cool. It's been a good day. This has um, been the first thing that we've done. This has been the first thing that we've done all summer. So, um, it's been good to get out the house and be able to do something. Kids got a chance to get in the water. It's really been nice out here. I think it's 97 with a heat index of 105, but it, you don't get that because of the, all the shade. My favorite part about the park was the creek because we got to swim in it. I've never seen seaweed before. I got to see and feel seaweed for the first time. It was really grassy, but also prickly in the soft kind gentle way. The weather was creek was really nice. We saw a pelican and Kendall thought it was an eagle <laughs> and there were a bunch of rocks that poked your feet. That, was, that really was a pleasant. It's hang on it. When we started the hike we got a map. The path was long. And I kept setting signs up that I hit them like... You think you were going to make it all the way to the end? Yes. Look at 
go down to the end lane. It was it was like a wham. My favorite part on the hike was we got to swim in the creek with Violet. Oh, she's my best friend. It was really nice being with my friend. I played Mr. Fox. It's a game where someone's a fox and then two people a couple feet away and they say, what time is it, Mr. Fox? And Mr. Fox says, what time is it? And whatever time he says, you have to have that time. <laughs> we went on a hike, we got to swim in a creek, we got to jump off a big rock, and I got to look at um, wild raspberries. I liked looking for the wild raspberries. I got to look at fresh wood from a fallen tree. Yeah, I really liked that. Remember, life is full of lessons. Life is full of lessons. Life is full of lessons, so we live and we learn. Hug each other. Like this. <laughs> <And> smile. <laughs> no smile. Smile. Don't, Don't forget, forget to subscribe. subscribe.